Hey, this is Jenny Jones, Digital Growth Hacks Club. Hey, listen, wanted to give you five quick minutes to some of the important pieces or the important aspects of what are people asking questions for when it comes to this new tool called Heartbeat or Heartbeat Community. Um, this is your first time to this channel. Please go ahead and like and subscribe. I do have a link to a longer, kind of more detailed walkthrough, but I wanted to just do this quick five minute walkthrough for you as some of the the saline points or some of the important points of this particular tool. So what you have here, what I have in front of you is the settings in uh, when it comes to sending out invites. And uh, I wanted to set up things a little bit different so you can actually see them. So what you have here is you actually have a link here. Uh, you copy this link. This is an actual um, a link that anybody you want to join as a administrator, they can use this link. Again, this is the administrator link. Careful, this link will allow users to join as an administrator. So you want them to join as an administrator, special link there. But if you want your users to join as a regular user, this is your link here. These are two different links. You just hit the copy and then send it to them. Now, they go through an onboarding status. I'm gonna show you onboarding, but it lets you know how, many, how much percentage that they have gone through and or you could um, you could send them the link for anybody to join or you can just send this link right here. You have add invites and what you can do is just put in, if you want to send three people an invite, it'll send that code out to them. You have their emails. You just put their emails in here and send those invites and they'll go out automatically. So that's what you'll do there. When you send out an email, what you're going to find is um, if you know, if you send out a link, let's start with the link. If you send out a link here first, this is what it's going to look like. They're going to get this link, right? They're going to get this link when they go to the email. So if you send out a regular copy and paste link, or if you have that link on a button on one of your websites already, they're going to get this particular, um, they're going to get this landing page and they can sign up via Facebook or Google or Discord or something like that, or they can just sign up by regular email, right? And what they're gonna do is send the email. The email is gonna come and the email is going to look like this. So when the email comes, it's gonna be from you, right? Whatever the name of your, your actual community is, it's gonna have your community logo there. And like I explained in the longer video, um, it's gonna have your particular community name, have everything about your community, and then you're gonna click join community here. But they have some light branding here, which is fine. I don't have a problem with it. I want my I want the actual platform to grow. So if that's an affiliate link, I would like that to help out as well because I would get paid and they would get paid, but that's an affiliate, right? And so then let me talk you through, we got about two minutes left. So let me show you some other key points. So if they decide to join, um, um, so that's how they'll get they'll get, they'll get the email or they'll get that particular piece, right? So let me show you this particular piece. This is the onboarding. So as soon as they go, as soon as they get the email, they're going to come to the onboarding. And this is how you set up your onboard. You can go, you can create a whole new onboarding profile and the onboarding takes them through, right? It takes them through a series of steps. It says, Hey, tell us what, tell us about yourself, right? What do you like about it? And so on and so forth. You can ask all of these different questions. These are your questions you can set up, right? I think that's very uh, key that you can customize the onboarding. You also, when they when they onboard, it takes them to the default. You can have them take the, the default um, channel is introductions. I think that's great because then they can talk about who they are and what's going on. And then you have the social links you can require them to put in. Um, and that's part of the onboarding. Also, you can have an onboarding video as well to welcome them to the community. That will come up um, once they um, once they go through the onboarding process. That will come up. If you want to see what the onboarding looks like, you can view the other video. It's a little bit longer. I think it's closer to 10 minutes. But I wanted to just give you a quick overview, uh, a five minutes worth of what this video does. Also, you can set up your custom domain here. And then you also, when they click on this logo here, it'll take them to another page that you can put in here, a customized page. 
whatever you want to put there. You can actually send out a weekly digest of all the saline points or the highlights of the community right here. All right, that's been your five minutes here with Heartbeat. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Please like and subscribe. Hope you're doing well. You guys take care. Be safe out there. Goodbye for now.